Now you guys, for the main show, <laughs> you're gonna see what I have picked for our overall core for the upcoming homeschool year for her. And we have decided to go with... Hi you guys, my name is Brittany and welcome back to my YouTube channel. You guys, in today's video, I will be sharing my six great homeschooling picks for the 2023 2024 homeschooling year. So if any of you guys are new here to my channel, again, my name is Brittany. I'm a homeschooling mom to three girls ages 11, five, and three, and I will be entering in my fourth year of homeschool, you guys. <laughs> so I am so excited. I am a little bit nervous, you guys, in starting off middle school. I really did a lot of research and I really took a lot of time in selecting the picks for my middle schooler because I really was looking into picking curriculum that was really going to suit her overall and it was really going to help me accomplish the goals that I want us to reach this homeschooling year. So you guys uh, without further ado I'm going to go ahead and get on into this thing. I have everything laid out and we're going to go ahead and start off with math. So with math you guys we are going to be continuing using math you see and we are going to be going into the zeta level. You guys switching to math you see this upcoming homeschool year was the best decision that I ever made. Brielle is doing so awesome in math and I'm so, so, so happy with the series. So this is Matthew C's data. She will be using the uh, live video lessons from Mr. Demi to get her uh, video instructions. And then for the Matthew C, her manipulatives actually changed. So she is going to be using the Matthew C, a decimal and, um, or this is the algebra and decimal insert. So she's gonna actually be using this insert kit for pre-algebra and for uh, the zeta level. So this is going to be her primary math. We are going to supplement this this year and I will share with you towards the end what we're gonna supplement her math with. So as far as grammar goes, we are going to be continuing with the Fix It Grammar series. So this is Fix It Grammar book four. We have completed three of the Fix It Grammar book series, you guys, and I absolutely love this grammar program. It's short, it's sweet, it's effective, it's very thorough, and I'm happy that we are um, continuing with the series. So um, because vocabulary was a struggle area for my daughter, I decided to add in an extra supplement for her for vocabulary and we will be using the word roots level one. So I don't have any anticipation on us completing this book because it's pretty thick <laughs> for a vocabulary book. We are just going to take our time in helping her build those vocabulary skills. Now you guys, for the main show, <laughs> you're gonna see what I have picked for our overall core for the upcoming homeschool year for her. And we have decided to go with Oak Meadow, you guys. I am so excited, you guys, because um, I am partnering with Oak Meadow to present you guys today's video. And I'm gonna share with you their entire grade six level all of the literature and all the things that Brielle is going to get up to this homeschooling year. I really love this curriculum because it is set up for the student. So I am really coming in in the back end as parent and as facilitator. Each week, my daughter gets the opportunity to choose from several selections of assignments. She's gonna be really hands on. A lot of the assignments are creative. It involves a lot of art and writing. And I'm really going to be able to see another side of my daughter while we are using this Oak Metal curriculum. So this is the English English curriculum and as you guys can see this is the student book and the teacher's manual you see how thin the teacher's manual is compared to the student book again because it is written to the student so the English and the history actually coincides together so in the English this year she will be learning how to write um, expository descriptive writing she's going to be doing opinion writing persuasive writing and she is also going to be uh, learning how to do MLA format you guys I didn't learn that till high school so uh, uh, this curriculum is really going to enhance those writing skills and I'm really really excited for her about that. So the English actually pairs along with the history and this year we are going to be going over ancient civilizations and again this is the teacher's manual and her student book. So uh, what's really cool about Oak Meadow is that when it's a lighter English week it means that it's going to be a heavier history week. So by doing the weeks together um, it's really really uh, it's really set up for the student and I really Really love how they automatically know okay if she's gonna be writing a paper in history I'm not gonna have her do a paper in English she's just gonna be doing grammar so it's really cool how they combined uh, the history and the English together in this Oak Metal series so here is all of the literature that Brielle is gonna be reading this homeschool year and I'm gonna briefly go over all the books so the first one is Maru uh, it says Maru of the Winter Caves I have the Rainbow People, 
The Golden Bull, The Shakespeare Stealer, The Eagle of the Knife, The Ugly One, this is Castle Diary, Once There Was, Twice There Was, and then I have two reference books that we're going to be using, which is Dallaire's Book of Greek Mythology. And you guys, this book is beautiful, like all the illustrations and things like that. And it. it's awesome. So I'm really, really excited as we are going to be talking about Greek myths, because again, we are going to be going over all of ancient civilizations. And then the last big reference book that came with the package is 101 Inventions and Awesome Facts of Muslim Civilizations. And again, you guys, this book is beautiful, like all the illustrations and things like that in it. So now for science, we are going to be doing Oak Metals Basic Life Science. And I'm really, really excited. Brielle's going to get an opportunity to really uh, master those skills as of writing like a lab report and things like that. We're going to be using our microscope this year. So I'm really, really happy. And I'm excited for us to dig in uh, really, really deep into life science. So uh, this right here is the student course book and then the teacher's manual as well. So to supplement Brielle's uh, math you see, we are going to go ahead and do the Oak Meadows math. The Oak Meadows math, you guys, is so clean and it's so simple. And I definitely think because this year, this upcoming homeschool year is a testing year for us in the state of Georgia, I do want her to get that spiral review of the other concepts that she learned in math you see already. So we're going to be using the Oak Meadows math as a supplement. And I really like how simple and thorough the Oak Meadows math is. It's really easy and I definitely think we're going to be able to pair it very well with the Matthew C. Zeta this homeschooling year. Now, you guys, uh, one thing I haven't showed you, and I'm not too sure about it, because as you guys can see, Oak Meadow is a is a pretty complete package. Like, I really didn't have to think about everything, anything. Everything's, like, really all laid out for me. And I'm, like, second-guessing this choice, but I'm going to show it to you guys anyway, because, you know, I love IEW. I actually purchased IEW in November, but because Oak Meadow is very heavy in writing, I don't know if we're going to need this. So I'm going to hold on to it, and if I find that I want us to start the IEW, IEW, we will probably start this in second semester and or we will start it the summer of her seventh grade year. So I do have this here. This is going to be definitely an honorable mention because you guys, you know, I love IEW. I definitely feel like the foundation that IEW laid is really going to prepare Brielle for all of the writing she is going to do in Oak Meadow. So I have this here. I don't know if we're going to use it or not, but it's just going to be an honorable mention for right now. And as our uh, middle school years uh, go on, I definitely will update you guys and, and let you know if we decided to add an IEW or not. Now for Brielle's electives, we kept it really, really simple this year. We are going to be doing music through Living Harmonies. This is from Thistles and Biscuits. Um, I'm really, really excited for her to learn all these musical instruments around the world. And I definitely think it will pair very well since we are going over ancient cultures and civilizations. So this is Living Harmonies. As far as her personal elective, she's going to continue doing creative writing. I am going to have her do a creative writing class throughout school this homeschooling year, and hopefully she'll have fun doing that. And she's also going to continue with piano through Hoffman Academy. Um, this is going to be our third year doing Hoffman Academy. Um, we are really nearing in the end of these units and I definitely think um, at this point I'm going to have to decide if I'm going to do like private piano lessons for her because she definitely is enjoying using Hoffman Academy and we're nearing the end of this program. So you guys, these are my six great homeschool curriculum picks. I'm so excited. Um, I just definitely want to let you know, flip throughs, uh, you definitely will see inside of Oak Meadow. I definitely will have like a lot of planning videos. Um, I will not leave you behind. I definitely will take you guys along this process as I'm learning a new curriculum. I'm so excited for us. And I definitely know this is going to be a rich and fun homeschooling year for us in starting off middle school. So as always, you guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I cannot wait, like I said, to update you guys on our journey with Oak Meadow. And I look forward to seeing everybody in my next one. Bye.